Okay, hello everyone. Today I'm going to do a quick little tutorial showing you how to clean up some audio in a free software called Audacity so that you can hear things like bird calls in the background. So to do this, I'm going to open a file that's just been sent on WhatsApp. Now I think this might be a pocket recording rather than a request for bird call identification, but it's still going to be perfect to illustrate the techniques I'd like to show. So I'll play it for you now. And if you've got your volume really high, you might be able to hear something, right? There's a little bit of rustling, maybe you've got sharp hearing and you can hear a little bit of bird call in the background, but it's really faint and it's not, not really good enough to, to do identification. Um, so there's two main problems with this, um, and we'll deal with them one by one, and you'll see how we'll repeat these solutions again and again to continually refine. So the first problem is the volume, right? It's all very, very quiet. Um, so I can fix this by going Effect, Amplify. And it's going to give us a little error because in Audacity, it needs to have some audio selected to apply an effect. So I'm going to select everything with Control A, then Effect, Amplify, and it's going to choose a value so you can just hit OK. Um, and this is going to amplify it such that the loudest noise is at full volume. And you can see in this case with these spikes that corresponds to volume, right, it's this noise over here, everything else is still fairly quiet. Um, but the, the recording is much louder. Um, okay, so that's not bad. Um, we might want it a little bit louder still, and the easiest way to do this is to take these noises, which are just rustles in the pocket, right? Like this this little section here. It's mostly this as someone um, touches the microphone. So you can just select that and hit delete. Um, likewise with this part at the end here. right? These are the really loud bits. Um, I'm just going to select it and hit delete. And you could do this for a few more portions. Now, control A, effect, Amplify, hit OK, uh, it's going to be able to raise the volume even more. Um, and we can do that a bit more to clean out some of these other noisy bits, but I'll do that just now. So now when we play it, we can hear everything a lot more clearly. The problem is we can hear the background noise. So um, this is a bit um, painful to listen to, especially if you've got high volume, and it's masking the sounds. The nice thing is Audacity is actually smart enough to remove this noise without destroying the rest of the signal. Um, but to do this, it needs to know which parts are noise. So if I select a portion, um, and I want to make it so that there's no bird calls or anything, just... Um, so let's just move it a bit. Just pshht, right? There's none of the important stuff in there. This is just the noise. And so now I want to tell Audacity this is what the noise looks like. Effect, noise reduction, and then I'm not applying a, a thing yet, I just want to get the profile. So I'm going to click Get Noise Profile. It now knows that this bit here is noise. Now I would like to noise reduce on the whole file. So again, Control A, Effect, Noise Reduction, and um, now we can select OK. I think you might be, not be able to see it. There we go. Um, OK and it's done that noise reduction. And you can see the volume of the background noise seems to have been reduced significantly. And so if we play it now, okay, that's, that's a significant improvement. The calls we're interested in are still very quiet though. And again, what's dominating is these um, rustles from the pocket. So I'm gonna be fairly ruthless. You could um, be very careful and, and listen to each one before you delete it. I'm just gonna remove these, um, these are like, yeah, um, it's bits of the signal that we're not interested in. Um, and so I'm going to remove those and that'll give us a lot more um, capacity to then focus on the important bits. Um, and again, I'm just selecting and hitting delete, selecting, hitting delete, selecting. Right, I don't know if that's a dog or something. Um, and it doesn't matter, I mean, you might be concerned about getting every part of the signal, um, sort of the bird calls at least intact. Um, this deleting, it does, it does um, change the timing, so uh, that's, that's a factor to consider. But still, um, you can see by removing those bits, it lets me bring the, the rest of the signal much, much louder. Now again, we're going to listen and we're going to hear lots of background noise. So again, just going to select a portion, effect, noise reduction, get noise profile, right? I'm going to teach it another bit of noise. Control A, effect, noise reduction, okay. Right, 
and you can do this as many times as you want. Um, and each time is going to improve it slightly, although at some point you do start distorting the full signal as well. Um, effect, noise reduction, okay. Um, but you can see already we're at this point now where, um, maybe let me do um, we have this audio that's been clean, we've re removed the background noise as much as we can, but we can still hear the bird calls. In fact, we can hear them much more clearly. Right, so you can hear the boo-boo, you can hear the tinker Um There's some other calls in there at the beginning. Beautiful. Um, so I hope you found that useful. Um, let me know if you've got any questions or if you managed to get this going yourself. Um, again, the software is free, it's easy. File, export, you can export it to whatever format you like. Um, so we can call this one clean. And it really makes a huge difference when you're trying to figure out what something is. Um, this version here versus the original where you've got your volume on full, it's really quiet, you can't hear anything over the background noise. So I hope you find that useful. Um, enjoy and thanks.